Welcome back. Here at Sister Circle, Black History isn't just one month, but it's all year long. We celebrate our culture every single day. And today we want to celebrate the black history that lives in each of us, starting with the incomparable Selena Johnson. Oh, hey, yes. <laughs> um, hey, yes. Um, well, you know, um, my mother, I think it was my mother Dad first. Dad's first. My dad's first. Mm -hmm. okay. So my dad, obviously, um, I got my name from my dad, Selena Johnson. My dad is Seal Johnson, um, um, African-American blues and R&B singer. Um, my dad was, I think he was the first African-American artist to have his lyrics published in Time Magazine. Wow. Um, he's also getting the, um, He's going to be inducted in the Blues Hall of Fame in Memphis this mm -hmm. March. Yeah, that's great. Um, so that's awesome. I didn't know that. And he just wrote a book that talked about how he, his, my great 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 grandfathers was well, great grandfather and his brothers were slaves, mm. and they owned the land. Well, they were they slaved the land, and then they later bought the land. Oh, nice. Mm, so um, that's my dad. So Thank he's Daddy. Black History as far as music is concerned, both him and I. Um, and then my mother was the first Black female police commissioner. Um, she ran for police commissioner in 1984, I think. Uh, but then after that, she just did, uh, she ran for mayor a couple of times and then she helped mayor campaigns and then she worked in the city of Harvey for many, many years. Um, she's always worked in the community and she's always been into politics. So my mother is black history as well. Yay. So. Yay for them. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully I can become black history no, when it's all history. said and done. Yes. People will look back and say, Selena Johnson was a national coordinator. Yeah. Black yeah. history. Yes, yeah. absolutely. You are yeah, now. Well, I guess I am. I'm black history. Yes, yes. say it. Say it. <laughs> okay, I'm going to start off with William Buck Godfrey, my daddy, who is the winningest high school football coach in DeKalb County history. Yes. All right, now, yeah. He has sent all 300 plus boys to college on scholarships. 85% mm. of them have received their bachelor's degrees. A number of them have received their master's and doctorates. Mm. Uh, he has a stadium named after him, Buck Godfrey Stadium in DeKalb County, Georgia. And he is my dad. Wow, Yay! that's my dog. I love him. <laughs> you know, um, he uh, is a football uh, giant. Uh, he's also the author of many books. He has poetry books, his recent books. His recent book is called My Friend Eddie, which chronicles his friendship with the late, great Eddie Robinson, who mm -hmm. was uh, was the winningest uh, college football coach for quite some time wow. at Grambling State University. Mm -hmm. So, salute to my daddy. Yay! All right. Why do you have to do <laughs> daddy? <laughs> Now, your voice got to go low. Uh, Dang. <laughs> so I also want to shout out my mama, Joyce Godfrey, who uh, actually like was the director of social services. She ran the entire social work department at Emory Hospital in the 80s, one of the first few black executives mm. in the hospital oh. across the country. Kitty. So she was definitely ahead of the bar when it came to social work and social services. Um, she's a licensed clinical social work. She has all that comma, dot, dot, dot stuff, mm -hmm. name behind her name. Acronyms. MS, yes, <laughs> MSW, all of that great stuff. She was also a professor at Morehouse um, College of Medicine. Wow. And she was also one of the charter members of the DeKalb County chapter of Alpha Kappa Alpha Sorority Incorporated, Lambda it, Epsilon Mama. Omega chapter. So salute to the Godfrey's, yeah. Yeah. my mama and my Dang. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I oh. can't even take it. <laughs> Are you black history, Rashawn? Oh yeah, I'm black history. Come on now. You know what I'm saying? I do a radio, I do a TV, all mm -hmm. that stuff. But I will say about myself in radio, I was one of like three in the country who led a hip hop and R&B morning show when I was doing the 18 morning show. I was the, the, the lead of that show. So shout out to all my radio girls Look out there. And yeah. was at the face. And uh -huh. was at the face. Uh -huh. <laughs> with the brakes that have it. Yes. Uh. Yes. Uh. He <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't, I don't even, I don't think I know where to start. I'm gonna start by talking with my mom because she is the first singer in our mm -hmm. immediate family. Mm -hmm. She's the one who taught us all how to sing. Wow. And she was also one of the very first United Methodist ministers, mm. a female, with her own church. Yes. In the Annapolis yes. area. Yes, her love full of new <laughs> for my mama. So with that, she's the one who taught us all how to sing. My dad, I love you, daddy, you can't sing. But um, he tries. Yes. So with that training, we became the Braxtons. First it was Tony Braxton, mm -hmm. who was of course the first lady of La Face. Yes. Yes. Uh, she went on to becoming the first 
African American Belle Get for in. Disney on Broadway. Mm. Uh, let's see, uh, what, 14 Grammys and what, nine AMAs? Tell it, yeah. well, tell I mean, it. The whole I, she's, she's, she's tell Tony Braxton. Millions that's, of records. That's, so. that's my sister. Oh my gosh, and she's the one who taught us how to behave in the industry. Mm -hmm. So it's because of her that we got our first record deal. Mm -hmm. In 1986, I was, about, I, was, no, I, was, I was about 13 years old when yeah. we got our first record deal, but mm -hmm. it was because of my sister Tony, because she always wanted to take us with, uh, with mm -hmm. her. Yeah. But we were just Aww. so young, especially Tamer and I, because we were the youngest. Yeah. She couldn't really sing the type of music that she wanted to sing. So when we had our whole thing with LaFay, she went by herself, and then she pulled us in. Yes. And made sure we had record deals. Yes. And now Aww. we're uh, a whole family show of Braxton Family Values, and yes. we're just making money together. Thank you, Holy Amen. And Look at uh, God. Uh, all female black family making black history. Oh, we yeah. absolutely. Yes. That's all right. We'll and, oh, oh, and we are, yes. you know, the number one television mm -hmm. show on oh, WeTV. We. Mm. Yes. But, uh, you know, since 2009, so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> since 2009, so. Yes, <laughs> Flagship <awesome>. shows, okay. <laughs> well, well, listen, I'll go ahead and close us out. Uh, first, I want to just start by highlighting us here. Um, at Sister Circle, we are all black history. You know, to uh, have a, a, a African American show uh, speaking from the viewpoint of four African American women, mm -hmm. we are all black history. Yes, ma'am. Okay? Yes, ma'am. Uh, and it's just been a pleasure, pleasure to do this with you guys every single day. Uh, I would like to say I'm black history. Yes, you are. I have uh, been acknowledged in by the city of Atlanta. I have my own day in Atlanta, June mm -hmm. 18th. Yes. And that's huge. I'm, I'm, I'm not from Georgia. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm from Tennessee. Come on. I'm from Memphis. And so for. Yes, you can. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let it out. Don't cry. Don't cry. It's all right, Swan. It's all right. Do do right. So to be um, acknowledged and highlighted from a city in which I've grown to love so much in a state that I'm not even from, uh, is truly immaculate and is black history. And I'm just so happy um, that God has blessed me with that. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. All right, yeah. we're not gonna get into the medicine being the only black television show yeah. about doctors out here, but that's okay. <laughs> and then that is true. That's we have true. to celebrate that too we now, have, most certainly, Most certainly we do. Yes. Uh, and, and then also being a part of Married to Medicine for now seven years. And mm -hmm. you know, that is within itself unheard of because most shows just don't last that mm -hmm. long. And especially being a show uh, that was unheard of at the time that it launched, we never had seen um, black doctors on TV and, exactly. and getting that inside look at uh, what it's like. Yes. And so yeah. I, I'm very privy to be a part of that. So that's my black history. Beautiful. Yes. Yes. Beautiful. Well, thank you so much to each and every one of us for sharing. We'll be right back.